Hunting Hill Chardonnay is, uh, is a single vineyard Chardonnay that is produced from a, um, a vineyard site which is here at the winery, right opposite from where the winery is on the hillside which uh, uh, got its name from um, basically, you know, my father and grandfather used to hunt up there with uh, you know, pheasants and rabbits in particular. But we, we planted the, the vineyard there in, in the late 70s, early 80s, and we had to replant it in 1999 with, uh, entirely with Chardonnay. Uh, we, we ripped out some of the other varieties. But the Chardonnay site itself has, uh, has a very, very lovely you know, floral nature to it. It's uh, produced in the same way as we produce the estate Chardonnay with the hand harvesting, whole bunch pressing and, and, and barrel fermentation. Uh, the Hunting Hill gets a little bit more uh, new oak because it can handle it. But the, the Chardonnay itself is, is quite distinct from the estate Chardonnay in that um, it has this very white flower or lemon lime blossom aroma to it and uh, uh, more of a sort of a, a touch of uh, mineral uh, about it which, which comes through on the palate as well rather than being sort of uh, the, the broad and rich and nuttier style of Chardonnay that you see with the estate Chardonnay. The Hunting Hill is very, very fine, very refined, quite long. Um, quite pure. Um, it's, uh, it's a lovely wine to have with, with crayfish, um, as we've uh, tried on a number of occasions and, uh, and certainly encourage other people to, to do so. It's also wine that does take a little bit longer in terms of bottle age to really come out of its shell. And um, the, uh, the very, very um, uh, fine or distinct element that, that's on the aroma sort of doesn't indicate the, the concentration and length of flavour that really this wine has. It really is very persistent, uh, very flavoursome and just I, I, I tend to not be able to praise it high enough. <laughs> so um, a really, really uh, lovely, refined, beautiful, complex uh, Chardonnay, just what we're looking for.